Hi, this is Kurt Repencheck with National Parks Traveler. Today we're at Dinosaur National Monument in eastern Utah. We've come to check out the Quarry Exhibit Hall. Now, several years ago, this uh, was actually shut down to the public because they had some problems with the structural foundation here, and the old facility was actually cracking and moving. Since then, though, they've built this beautiful new facility. Let's go inside and take a look at what they've done. A rich fossil chalk portal into the Jurassic period lies within the Carnegie Quarry Exhibit Hall at Dinosaur National Monument in Utah. Though the landscape of the nearly 211,000 acre monument is passed down from the Jurassic period, it's easiest to gaze back into this prehistoric time inside the Exhibit Hall. It was back in 1909 when paleontologist Earl Douglas came upon the fossil studded cliff face that is the hallmark of this national monument and he was among the first to suggest that the fossils be left in place for visitors to see. Spend a little time studying the cliff face and you'll see the fossilized remains of Allosaurus, Diplodocus, Stegosaurus, and other dinosaurs that roamed this landscape 149 million years ago. All told, there are about 1,500 fossil remains here. Talk about a Jurassic world.